what your favorite Grand Theft Auto says about you. Grand Theft Auto 1 and 2. If you've played all of the GTA games and one of these two games are your favorite, your mind is unfortunately plagued with nostalgia disease. These games did not age well at all. In fact, I would not be surprised at all if GTA London 1969 was in your top 3. Grand Theft Auto 3. This game made the GTA franchise start to become a serious force in gaming. The 3D game design was considered very impressive back in 2000. And the game is still very playable in 2024, which is insane. You've probably got a small case of nostalgia disease, but GTA 3 story and atmosphere were executed well. And even playing around with the flaws in this game can be entertaining. Grand Theft Auto, Vice City. This game had a really cool vibe with the AT setting, and you'd argue that the Vice City storyline is simply unmatched. You also like the fact that the map was pretty small, even though the map is probably one of the most criticized aspects of the game. Grand Theft Auto, San Andreas. You'd make the claim that this is the most iconic game of the franchise. That take would be pretty valid, considering the fact that the characters and missions are constantly mentioned in the mainstream media today, 20 years after the game's release. Grand Theft Auto 4. Roaming around the map in this game is a strange experience in a very good way. The atmosphere and map design is very artistic and vibrant on one hand, but it also feels very gritty and real at the same time. You'd argue that Nico Bellic is easily the best protagonist of the entire franchise by a mile, and that the side characters of GTA 4 are far superior than many of the main characters in the other GTA games. You also love how you could choose how the story played out. Let's say you chose the option to save a character's life. The consequences of your actions would play out as the story went on. This is a feature that you wish was more pronounced in GTA 5, as you probably aren't a huge fan of the games that are too linear. Also, I think that any GTA fan would agree that the GTA 4 theme song is the most iconic. Grand Theft Auto 5. You're aware that this game made the GTA franchise a household name. This game was released over a decade ago, yet it stomps and the majority of games released as as you're watching this video right now. You have three main protagonists that are all incredibly well written with top tier character to character chemistry. Even if GTA 5 Online never came to be, you'd still argue the other GTA titles could not even compare to 5 story mode. But wait, Online does in fact exist alongside the story mode, which is why you'd claim that GTA 5 is the best or at least one of the best games of all time.